Hi there, this is Lynn Allen. Welcome to another AutoCAD tip courtesy of Catalyst Magazine. And I'm afraid that unlike the last tip, there are no puppies in this one. So I'm just hoping that you're going to like the AutoCAD tip. No puppies. <laughs> Today we're going to be talking about a command that used to be an express tool. Grew up, became a real life AutoCAD command, and that is lay merge. And it merges two layers together into one layer, and then it deletes the other layer. It's a pretty cool command really helpful if you bind X refs into your drawing and you want to take the layers from the X refs and put them on one of your layer standards, right? One of the regular layers that you already have in the drawing. So let's take a look at lay merge. All right. So to find it, it's underneath layers. That makes sense. And it's a little icon right here, which I guess shows one layer or two layers merging into another because you could actually take a whole bunch of layers and put them on one layer and then get rid of all those extra layers. Nice, nice way to clean up your drawing file. All right, so let's try it, lay, merge, all right? So my goal today is that I have a couple of dimension layers and I really just want one. So I, as you can see, I have some dimensions here that are blue, I'm assuming they're on one layer. I have some dimensions here that are magenta and they're on a different layer. And actually the target layer is this layer right here, the magenta ones, all right? So you can do this two different ways. You can select the objects that are on the layer that you want to merge to another. So you have to select an object. Okay, so these guys are wrong. You'll see it finds all of the objects on that layer. And I could pick multiple objects for multiple layers if I wanted to. You could, you know, do all different ways of, of, of doing this. And then hit an enter because I'm done selecting the objects on the layers that I want to merge. And then it wants to know what the target layer is, right? And that happens to be this one over here, right? That's the magenta one. So as soon as I do that, it's going to freak me out and warn me because <laughs> these dimensions, it's, you know, their dimensions aren't just individual objects. They're kind of like a block definitions, which is what it's saying here. They're not blocks, but there are four block definitions, which reference the layers of the blocks that you're going to be redefining. It's just letting you know that. And if this was a block, it would actually go into the block and redefine the block on the fly. It's a very powerful, powerful command to contain the new layer and get rid of the old ones, right? So do you wish to continue? Once again, the default is no, very similar to layer delete. So you have to pay attention. Yes, I want to continue. So you do have to do Y for yes. And then poof, there we have it. All of those objects are on the same layer and it deleted a layer called dimensions. All right, gone. <laughs> Pretty cool. Let's remember where there's power, there's danger, right? <laughs> okay, I'm going to undo that and we'll do it the other way. All right, so let's go back into lay merge. I'll be a good girl and I'll grab it from the ribbon, right? Try and use a ribbon more. And this time I'm going to say end for name. And as it turns out, let's see, I want to merge all of the layers on this layer called dimensions. Same situation, hit another enter because I'm done. I only want to change, merge this one layer. And now I have the target layer. And once again, I can either select objects on the target layer or I can say end for name and I can pick them from the list. So I can come down here and I can say, and you can also see you can key it in. I want them to go on this layer, dimensions, COTUS, right? All right. That's the destination, that's the target. Hit an OK. Do you wish to continue? So this time I don't get it in text form. I get it in the little dialog box, so it's a little bit friendlier. <laughs> so yes, absolutely. Does it yell at me quite as much when I, when I select them from the list, does it? <laughs> it's a little friendlier. So those are the two different ways you can use layer merge. I highly recommend that you do so. It's a nice way to clean up your join files. And I want to thank you for joining me today even without the puppy. And I'm going to see you back here in two more weeks. Thank you so much for joining me.